Wow, Colorado Street Bridge, how beautiful. Hey guys. <laughs> Welcome. What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Thanks for coming back. Subscribe. Whoa. Subscribe if you're new, just Subscribe. do it right now. Welcome to the finale of calling terrifying phone numbers. You got my last video to 100,000 likes, so we are here today at Suicide Bridge, which I'll show you in a second. We're gonna call some scary numbers. I got some new ones. You I, did? Yeah. You found more? Found more. I um, asked a lot of you guys online to send me some, so they could be fan numbers, oh possibly. <laughs> Who knows, but guess what? I got a you track phone. Why does every track phone you have to speak? This reminds me of my ex-girlfriend, just never shuts up. <laughs> but anyways, guys, I hope you're ready because we're about to call some scary people. Right here, what you guys are all looking at is Suicide Bridge. I've been here multiple times before with Elton, my uncle. When I'm with Elton, usually I'm underneath the bridge filming and playing the Ouija board. But, but this time, you're on top. I'm on top because there's hardly any service under the bridge. Let me give some backstory really quick. Apparently, you can see like a little girl walking walking across the street sometimes late at night. Oh my gosh, those two people scared me oh, right there so bad. Where did they come from? Were these gates here last time? No, see that's weird. If you guys go to Elton's channel and look, you can even see us climbing on these. These gates were not here, but now they have gates for every single platform or whatever you want to call it. Which means that a lot of people were committing suicide. But here's another story I forgot to tell you about, Brad. There was a lady here at one point who took her baby, threw it off, and the baby survived. How? It landed in a tree. And it didn't die. And it didn't die. It like landed on a tree and went bunk, 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 What happened to the lady? She jumped afterwards and killed herself. Watch me see a lady holding a baby or something. Oh shoot, I would start crying. I would cry too. That's the coolest view I've ever seen in my life. I was talking about you. But anyways, guys, we are going to set up camp like right in the middle of the bridge and call some scary numbers and hopefully we get something cool today. The guy on the bike last time, like that was not funny. Like, I was literally not moving. Like you could see me change from how I was in the beginning of the video to just boom, like this guy is watching us, bro. Yeah, yo, we had a stalker in my last video. Was it was terrifying. so scary. I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like really quick. It's like a big construction site. I don't know if you can see it, but it's very, very far down. You would definitely um, die if you jumped off. Crazy. If you jump, I will, I will jump, jump too. too. We, we will, will fall together. together. Let me know in the comments below if you see anybody or see anything behind us. Cause that would be awesome. That would be not awesome. It'd be scary. Home screen. What was that? The home screen? No. The footsteps right next to it. Oh, there, there's two people behind us right now. Oh, those mother freakers. Those mother freakers. <laughs> <laughs> So like I was saying, I had no idea where to get these numbers. I asked a lot of fans and they sent me numbers, so... Did they give explanations of the numbers? Yeah. This person DM'd me this number and said, It's a number for a creeper hotline in Texas. 254-317. Damn, so if this is fans' numbers, like, they're just getting leaked. <laughs> oh. Call failed. Call failed. Call, call failed. end. It didn't even work. So thank you, Zelly Bear. Sweet. I didn't call this for myself, so I don't know what will happen. Cool. 630-296-7536. <laughs> I swear to God, if none of these work. Does this phone even work? Are you, have you, did you make sure? Let me just see if this phone even works. Please, dear God, mommy, please. All right, guys, I'm in the middle of trying to figure out what's going on with the track phone. I think we see somebody right behind Home us. Screen. This is the moment of truth. I'm calling myself. Call and I guess I have terrible service here. I'm not sure, but every single call I've been doing has been saying call failed or call ended, which has never happened with the track phone before. So I think we might just go back to Brendan's place in the usual spot and just do it. But before we leave, we gotta get the thumbnail here so it looks like we did it. <laughs> you have to fool right. everyone. This is what clickbait is. Hey, you know what we tried? Yo! I can't show my number, but now it's working. I just called oh, myself. Oh shit, okay, so let's go back and do it then. It's not gonna work over there. Let's just do it right here, right in front of the bridge. Oh, okay, let's do it. I'm so happy it's working. We don't have to go all the way back to Brennan's place, yes. So let's try that first number again. Oh, we totally roasted Zelly Bear and it was our fault. Yeah, sorry Zelly Bear. Sorry Zelly Bear. Hello? Hi. Who is this? Who is this? Is this um, somebody named Zelly Bear? Yeah. Yeah? Nice to meet you, Zelly Bear. Yeah. They just put their number. I thought you said this was a creeper hotline in Texas. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> wow, you're you're a giant liar. You know what? You duped us. You duped us real good. Well, hey, good talking to you. We're gonna continue this video. Okay. All right, I love you. Love you too. Yeah, Zelly Bear just duped us so what hard right pun. there. All right, so this is another number of fans sent me. Maybe this is a bad idea. Two nine six seven five three six. Uh, 
an answer? It was the Booth World Industries number. The one, the that one that's like, us? your number has been locked in a trace. Yeah, that's bold crap. This number is so scary, it, it a girl who killed her sled, but police say her dad raped her, and that in 2001, me and my mates call, and she picked up. What the f did that even mean? That sounds like a bunch of hooey jooey to me. 77451821248. This is not even gonna let me call it, I can tell already. Your call cannot be completed as Oh, it's wow. It's because it's a foreign number. This is a good video so far. We haven't done anything, it's probably like six minutes in. <laughs> so sorry guys. Right, we're calling the numbers that y'all gave us. This is a scary number, when you call someone, we'll answer and ask what you want them to do. Four, three, five? So like we could be like, we want them to lick our ass, sir? I mean, if you want that to happen. Yeah! Yeah! Five, seven, zero, four, seven, eight. It's they didn't even, even finish the number! Uh, Are you kidding me? We're gonna call it anyways. This is a great video. Oh Jesus, those people always scare the crap out God, of me. God, hey Colby, you should call blank number. At one point this number was used for figuring out the time and temperature, but now it plays the weirdest recording. 315-474-8481. We're calling scary people right now. Yeah. You guys doing EVP? Yeah, we're we're ghost adventure companies. Ghost adventure. Yeah. Happen to respect tolerance. Peace. Priorities. Taking care of your responsibilities. Honesty and integrity and morals. <laughs> this is strange. People should be focusing on those qualities what and not greed and destruction and abusing people and abusing animals. You can't be decent and tolerant and respectful to people you should just stay home and spare people the subjection of your miserable behavior. Did you hear what she it said? It talks about abusing people and animals. Yeah, she was just like, yeah, you guys should not abuse people and animals. It's messed up. Free MPX, thank you for that. So this one is just 000, 000, 000, 000, 000, 000, 000, 000, 000, 000 and dead people usually use this number to get in contact with loved ones. Hopefully. Yeah, because dead people have cell phones to call their loved ones. 303, we're just gonna fire through these. 309-0004, please, dear God, give me something good. Oh, it's busy. Somebody's already talking to this. Wow. Alright, that's a little strange. 386-98317. Here we go. Oh, it's ringing, yes. I'm sorry, the person you were trying to reach has a voicemail box that is not- Well, it's someone's asking. number. This one says, government will say you're under surveillance and will detain your family. 866 445 6580 We're sorry, the number you are trying to reach is no longer in service. Great, love my- Frick. I don't think I'm ever gonna ask my audience to send me numbers again. <laughs> because that's not working! Oh, yeah, yeah, you can go for it, though. It's all good. Like a music video? Yeah, yeah, we're shooting actually a music video right now. That's what makes you beautiful. It makes you beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> Why is this such like a date spot for people? I don't understand. There's there was like two couples that walked by and they're like, hey, what's up? Yeah, we're just hanging out. Nine eight seven six Brother, seven. There's one. this piece of glass. Let's use it to sacrifice our lives. Five five eight seven. This is supposedly said to give you an instant brain clot from a horrible noise. I'm gonna throw this phone off. Why would you want to call something that's gonna give you an instant brain clot? I'm just gonna call them until it works. Oh, look at the coyote! Ooh, they're looking at us, bro. If that thing comes at me, bro, I'm gonna kick it. Should we go pet it? Let's try it, come on. Hey! Daddy! Oh! oh! We almost just witnessed the death of a coyote. Hey, it's coming towards us. Oh, f Run, run! No, don't run, don't run, don't run! Why would you run? Because you said, run! <laughs> well, I thought he was charging us, I got scared. Chased out by coyotes? We're gonna keep calling these numbers, but, um, apparently you guys suck at giving me right yeah, numbers. Yeah, look at this number that they gave you. Alright, so I'm gonna call this one. I'll tell you the number if it works. It's busy. That was, like, literally almost all the numbers that I was sent. I've already tried it, like, ten times. So we're just gonna call Wrinkles again. 407. Brother, yeah. There's something out there. I don't know if it's a coyote or something, but I am seeing a shadow. Where? Oh, I see it, bro. 407-734-0254. Now, for all the new viewers that haven't seen any of the other series of this, Wrinkles the Clown is apparently a clown that you can call, and he will scare children for you, and he's like 80 years old. Maybe Wrinkles is dead, and that's why he doesn't answer. <laughs> we miss you, Wrinkles. Please answer. No, I do reach Wrinkles the Clown. I'm not getting to get call. Hey Wrinkles, I don't know if you remember us, but we just want you to come and suck our fat c Answer the phone because we want to suck some clown
Yeah, so just call me back at 911. <laughs> so here's the last two numbers. We're gonna try our best. Sorry, this has kind of been a dud so far, but at least we saw coyotes. So. We did see some coyotes. This one doesn't have any description. It's 630-296-7536. Hello? It's something. Hello? Yo, it just ended. It just ended. It just ended. That was, was something that scream? screaming, bro. That sounded like someone screamed. That was a hundred percent somebody screaming. Yo. That's scary. It sounded like a recording. It didn't sound like an actual scream. Yeah, like it almost like it was, was really weird. far. Or it was really far from the phone. From the phone, like somebody was like. Ah! Last number. 605-475-6968. Oh, it answered, it answered. Hello? Did it say something? Did it say something? It went, oh. Hello, oh yes. Hello? Is anybody there? Oh my gosh, it just ended. What did it say? I don't know, I just went boom. Should I call it back really quick? It could have been a recorded message, who knows. Is anybody there? Are you pushing? No, no, I'm not pushing anything. Is anyone on the phone? Say something. Can you say that again? It just ended again, bro. Did it say call jump ended, or hang up? Ended. I don't know, because that sounded like to me it was like hang up. How much of coincidence is it that last number we call says jump and we're on suicide bridge? Oh sh that just made sense now. I wouldn't know we're here. Unless there's like, it was just like a ghost number. You know how you, it says you can like contact spirits by calling certain numbers? What if we actually just contacted the spirit on the phone? That was actually so scary. Last phone call we had, somebody said jump, we're at Suicide Bridge. So I feel like we called and a spirit or something picked up around here. So we're gonna go grab the Ouija board really quick. And for Brennan's video on his channel, we are going to play the Ouija board here and see if we can get anybody to talk to us. I really hope you enjoyed the finale of Calling Terrifying numbers leave a like on this video if you enjoyed it i'm not gonna set a like goal but just leave but a like but wait i want to add something into your video bro let's hear it since this was the finale guys let's try to do colby a solid and let's like try to pass the mark of the last one what was the last one at what did it get hundred something hundred thousand yeah can you guys get this video more than a hundred thousand likes more than a hundred thousand let's likes. see Let's try to beat his personal record. You're the best, bro. Of course, bro. Also, I need you to do me a huge, huge, huge favor. I want to keep doing these scary videos for you because I know a lot of you guys out there like it. So comment down below in the comment section what I should do, whether it's like playing scary games, maybe like checking out like scary Instagram accounts or reading scary text messages, anything like that. Let me know in the comment section below and I'm going to make Brennan do it with me. <laughs> <laughs> Why do I always get suckered into this? <laughs> We're gonna take this phone. We gotta get rid of it. We gotta get rid of it somehow. What's the best way to get rid of this? At Suicide Bridge? I think you just throw it off the bridge, bro. Oh yeah, should I destroy the SIM card first? Nah, f that. The finale of Calling Terrifying Numbers. We did it, bro. We did we it, We survived bro. it. We survived. We don't have to do this ever again. Good stuff. I love you. Love you too, bro. I wanna hear it? Didn't even make a noise. Bro. Damn, it's still falling. <laughs> <laughs> I feel relieved. I feel like, like glad that it's over, to be honest. It's over until we figure out another scary game. Great. So, anyway. <laughs> Great. <laughs> like this video, comment down below your favorite part, or a scary thing I should do next. And I will see you guys next time. I love you so much. You're the best. Peace. <laughs>